class family. It's time for calendar and weather. Do you remember what month we're in? Hmm, I know it starts with a D. What month is it? December. It is December. I wonder what day we are on. What number comes after 16? Maybe you can help me out. Let's use our resource, the hundreds chart. Here's the number 16. What comes after? 17. Let's go ahead and get 17 because it is December 17th, 2020. Let's add this to the calendar. And do you remember what today is? Hmm. I wonder what is it? Do you know the day of the week? Let's go ahead and use our resource. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Well, I remember yesterday was Wednesday. So what's today? Th Thursday, Thursday. Let's go ahead and get Thursday and we're going to add it to the calendar. So today is Thursday. Do you know what yesterday was? Remember, it starts with a W. You're right. Yesterday was Wednesday. Do you know what tomorrow will be? Hmm. It's the one that starts with an F. F Friday. Friday. So tomorrow will be Friday. Let's add this to the calendar. What season are we in? Do you remember? Let's look at our resource to help us out. What season are we in? Well, let's see. Here's December. What season is it? Winter. Winter. So let's go ahead and get winter. And we're going to add winter to our calendar. And boy, it looked like winter so much yesterday with the snow. And you might have noticed the snow that's still on the ground. So it's not going to snow again today, but it is very what? Hmm. Describe the temperature to me outside. It is cold. It's definitely cold. I would agree with you. Definitely cold. There is ice outside. Be very, very careful if you're walking outside. It's very icy. I don't want you to get hurt and slip. So earlier this morning, it was cloudy, but it's not looking cloudy anymore. Do you know what it's looking like? Well, the sun is shining some. I think it's going to be partly cloudy today. I think the sun's going to come out even more later, but... It might be partly cloudy. Let's go ahead and add partly cloudy. And we need to do up. Oh, how many days have we now been in school? I have the number 66 from yesterday. Do you know what number comes after 66? Hmm, let's go ahead and see. Here's 66. What's after? 67. So we need to make. 67. So we're going to have a 6 and a 7 for 67. Let's add this to the place value chart. So I'm going to add one counting rod to my ones pocket. And then let's start with our six tens. How many tens? Six tens. Can you skip count by tens with me? Ready? 10, 20, 30, 40. 50, 60. Do it one more time. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. Get 60 in your brain. You have it there? Keep it and let's put the seven ones with the 60. So we have 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67. All right. Let's go ahead and do our tally mark. You're going to pull straight down for your tally mark. So let's go ahead and do that. How many days have we been in school? 
5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 66, 67. Let's write the date. Okay, remember, something to write on and something to write with. If your dry erase board is nearby, that would be really fast. Put your cap on the bottom so you don't lose it. So December, and it's going to be the 17th, 2020. Go ahead and write the date at this time. And remember, when you're done writing the date, you're going to take your cap of your marker and make sure it goes at the top part. And you're going to have to press it down and hear the click, okay, so that the marker doesn't dry out. All right, let's go ahead. Write the date down fast. 